Hello, me, Shani D, back with another video. It's been a hot minute. A lot has been going on. There was the election and Thanksgiving and life. So I wasn't able to make that many videos, but I was definitely thinking about making videos and what I wanted to make. Uh, and today I am making a thrifting haul. So I've been thrifting a lot recently for my Depop and I will link that below and also maybe right here. Wonderful. So if you like any of these items, most of them will be up on my Depop. Some of them will be going into my own personal collection because I do love clothes. I got 32 items of clothes for $32 to a undisclosed location in Southern California where you can get clothes for a dollar. So I did that and I spent $32 and now I have 32 items next to me. They are all just been washed and I have a few more items that I thought were like pretty chef's kiss iconic. So I will also be showing you those as well. So let's get into it. Okay. First item I have to show you are these Levi jeans. They're fairly long. I don't under, I think they're like probably straight leg, boot cut, something like that. But anyway, these probably don't fit me. I'm going to try and sell them on my Depop as jeans first. If they don't sell in a couple weeks, then I'm planning to cut up a bunch of Levi's. I've already kind of bought a few pairs and to make them into purses because I got a purse from a friend. Shout out Emily Shapiro if you're watching this. Hi, Emily. I got a bag from her and everyone's been complimenting me on it and I really love it myself. So I figured I'll make some more and maybe sell them on Depop or give them to people for the holidays because everyone could always use a cool new bag. Okay, going on with the jean trend. This item, very like, when I showed it to my mom, she mentioned the outsiders. Totally see that for sure. It's very cool. Um, it is an extra large. It's from Coast. I don't know that brand, but this is probably going to go into my personal wardrobe. I'll maybe wear it a few times and then post it on my Depop. Got this Pepsi shirt with this cool checkerboard going down the sleeves. It's cropped. It's tie-dye, I guess, if you want to call it that. Some sort of acid wash. Uh, it is a size large, don't know if I said that already, but yeah, that will definitely be going on my Depop because I am not a size large, but if that were my size, I would be keeping it because I think it's cute, even though I'm a Coke girl. Okay, this is like a huge sheet of fabric that I'm thinking I'm going to keep uh, either for like a backdrop or to line those jean purses. So we'll see, but I love that color green. This is probably the best find. It will be staying in my personal collection if it fits well. Big old like workers jumpsuit in navy. It has some awesome little details on it. Like on the sleeve, there's like a little pocket, lots of little like button closure details. It's super long. Oh, also, they have like a zipper on the bottom of the legs. I think it's so cool. I really hope it fits. It reminds me of Big Bud Press because I know they have a lot of like jumpsuits like that that are like you know, up to like 60, 80, 100 bucks each. And this was a dollar. Theirs are super cute. I want to purchase them, but I'm, I don't have that much money. So hopefully that will be my, um, my little like dupe. So this isn't a medium. It's just this pink vest. I thought it was like Y2K, like someone who's into that like early 2000s vibe would like it. 
uh, it's a medium yeah and it's got like cool netting on the inside this I'm not sure how exactly to wear it um it definitely gives like Native American vibes which I appreciate I think of the colors of this um, I don't know if it's culturally appropriate for me to wear, unfortunately, um, just because of like the cut, but I do genuinely love the material, so I'm not sure what to do with this, but it was a dollar and I figure it's really pretty to look at and it's a nice material, so if anything, use it for scrap material or just keep it and let it just sit and maybe try and sell it on Depop and see like if someone else could style it well. This is a Dickies 3XL. I'm still not sure if I'm going to post this on my Depop or if this is going to go into my personal collection or if I'm going to give it to my dad for Hanukkah. So we'll see. But there's like, hmm, where is it? Oh, here's a little like Dickies emblem. I just think it's it's basic, but it's nice. Okay, so we got a bright pink Columbia sweatshirt or zip up hoodie. Not even a hoodie. What am I saying? It's just a zip up. It's pink though, and it's Columbia. It says it's a large. I think it's a children's large because that that doesn't look like a large to me. So maybe someone who's like a small or an extra small can buy this off my Depop. Okay. This sweatshirt reminds me so much of something that like they would sell at Patagonia however it's not Patagonia it's this like I don't even know it's got like some space logo it's very cute I it doesn't have a size and it. it has like no tag whatsoever these buttons on it like they were really really cute um I love the little straight detail. I love the colors of it. It's definitely something that I, if it was like posted online, I would have like saved it to my like Instagram likes or something. I love sweaters like that. So hopefully you guys do too. This is like a Timberland striped long sleeve. Fairly basic, but you know what? It's good to have those for winter. This is like a big tapestry it's it's legit it's huge it's very cottage core which is why i like it um it's kind of like cottage core garden like summertime there's a lot happening in it and i love it um i'm gonna try and sell it on depop or maybe put it even in my room i might i might it doesn't fit the vibe like perfectly but i think it's really pretty and uh, if it doesn't end up in my room, it could end up somewhere else in my house. Or Depop. We'll figure it out. But definitely love that. I've seen that people are really into these, like, cute little short no sleeve sweaters. I figure good for, like, fall and winter vibes. Kind of, um, like, dark academia <laughs> vibes as well, which is, like, very popular. Uh, it's an extra large. Yeah. It's a good material. This is another piece that I'm a little unsure of. I think I'm going to try and sell it on Depop, but yeah, it's, it's a, it's a vibe. I love the colors and I like the print and again, it was a dollar, so can't go wrong. This is like from Target Wild Fable line. It is a size small. It's just like a little striped sweater. I figure... There's nothing wrong with it. Yeah, it's Target, so it's not like that unique or special, but it looks cozy and it's cute and it'll be a lot cheaper on my Depop than probably it would be at Target. Okay, this is definitely going into my personal collection, so sorry if you wanted it, but it's a Wrangler long sleeve. It's gray. I don't really own gray. I own a lot of, I own a lot of black. I don't know a lot of gray. It's got like the little emblem right here. It's cute. I definitely need more like long sleeves and high quality things of that nature in my own personal wardrobe. 
definitely giving to my dad. It's one size too big for him, but you know what? He likes a little looser fit anyway, and he loves a button-up Hawaiian shirt. So that is for him. I got this dress barn 2X, this red with a little tie. Oh, it's so cute. My mom really likes it, so I might give to her or I might put it on Depop. So if you're seeing this mom, <laughs> sorry. I don't know. I think it might be a little too big for her anyway. This basic red turtleneck, perfect for the holiday season coming up. It's a size large. It's from New York and Company. I might have already said that. I can't remember. But yeah, it's an, it's like a nice, thick, good material. Okay, this shirt's funky. I don't, I think this is definitely going to go up on my Depop. It is a size large slash extra large. And it's got like in black and white on the back. Super funky. This top, probably like a small or an extra small, maybe a medium, because it has a little stretch. But it's just so dainty and so cute. And I love the like neckline. I love the sleeves. They have like a cute little like details. Ugh. And the color, perfect. Perfect. My mom really liked this as well when I showed it to her but it's just like, I don't even know, like a little cardigan sweater. Um, the sides are see-through. Well, not super see-through, but like, you know, you can see through it. It's so like, that's an awesome detail. And the, I guess, buttons on it are really cute too. So this is, yeah, like an awesome, I'm pretty sure it's vintage. It's a medium yeah so super cute wish it was my size however it is not okay speaking of things that are not my size this is definitely not but if a small person is interested I think this is super cute and great for the holidays because it's that green it's a JC Penney's it's medium however 100% acrylic however I think it's probably smaller than a medium although it has like a little stretch to it um I love the little details on the side here of these sleeves um, but since it's vintage yeah I think it probably will fit more of a small or even like an extra small but hey however you like to wear your clothes okay this jacket is so funky and cute and definitely has like great boho vibes I love the colors it's I don't know if I know the size of this. I, based on the way it looks, like maybe a small or a medium, I just, oh, I love the texture of it. I love the colors. I love it. It's just got great details to it. Like, uh, obsessed. I feel like that's going to get sold pretty quickly. Okay, this is an extra large. This is, uh, I'm pretty sure it's like vintage Sears, but these colors for winter, oh, the Christmas season is upon us. Well, I'm Jewish, so it doesn't really matter to me, but to other people, it's upon us. Okay, this is a Bill Paul, I don't know what that exact, I don't know that designer or whoever constructed this garment. But this is it. It's kind of, it looks like it's more for someone who's a little more petite. But I love the colors. Again, Christmas time is coming. It's coming. These buttons. So cute. Oh, and the collar. It's like a little black velvet moment. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. You can see that my pile is stacking up now on this side. Mm -hmm. Okay, so so I told you guys I also threw in some items that I didn't get from 
the sale today. These are from thrifting this past week for Black Friday. So, ooh, ooh. <laughs> these things have hangers, the other ones did not. So these are a very funky print. I think they're size large. Yes, Adidas. Got the little like Adidas emblem, cute. And it's got the three stripes going down it. I just think this like very funky and like boho retro, but still like sporty spice. And I like bringing and meshing the two styles together. So for a very tiny person, these jeans, look at these details, the little braided numbers going on on the pockets. So cute. This is just the back and then, and if they don't sell as jeans, then I'll probably make it into a purse because I just love those little braided details so much. So this next item is probably... <sighs> I don't want to say it's my favorite, but it's definitely one of them. Uh, this will be up on my Depop because I cannot fit into them, unfortunately. Which, that's like most Tommy things, and I love Tommy Hilfiger, so it stinks that they don't make that much plus size uh, options. These are a size 33-34, so I think that's men's sizing, but um, whatever. So they are Tommy. They've got the little flag detail. They got the little Tommy on the back. Here is the back. Got this little Tommy emblem on the side. And then it kind of like flare, not like super flares out, but I guess my mom called them like skateboarder pants. Um, so it says Hill Figure on the bottom. And it says on the other side too. And it's so cute. I love it so, so much. They're just, they're so cute. And they're like a dark gray wash. I wouldn't call them black. And there's like a little distressing, which like kind of adds to the aesthetic, I think. So, uh, <laughs> they're so cute. They are so cute. They will never fit me, but I hope to see them on another cute person. Okay, we've got gorgeous fall vibes, winter vibes, sweater, kind of boho chic moment. Love that. That will be going on Depop, that's not part of my personal collection. Okay, this piece, oh, this is the back, whoops. This piece is so cool, I love the colors. I love the print. I like the cut. It's not my size, so we'll be going with my Depop. My mom and I looked this brand up. Apparently these jackets are selling new for like 200, 300 bucks. So we'll see how much we can get from it. Jacket, this color. Okay, it's a size 20, which like that's one of the best parts about being plus size living in Southern California is that hardly anyone is your same size. So, yeah, you get a lot more picks of clothes. It's just, it's so nice. The material, so soft. I love it. This sweatshirt's gonna get me demonetized. Not that I even am monetized at the moment. But anyway, one day. We've got this Ralph Lauren polo size large. Striped. It's like a baby, not baby blue, but like a lighter blue. Got the little emblem on it. And look at these button details. Got this 2XL long flowy like brown skirt. It does make noise. It's just this cute little purple sweater with a turtleneck. And yeah, I like the sleeves a lot because it kind of like cinches in a little bit. I think it's like kind of 80s vibes, so really cute. I think it's probably a small, maybe a medium. So that will be up on my Depop. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you are st still watching, thank you so much. And yeah, feel free to check out 
my Instagram. I will link that below as well as my TikTok, which I'm like starting to get the hang of TikTok. At first it was like really hard, but now I'm definitely doing better than I was before. I'm not doing good. I'm not doing well, but I'm doing better. <laughs> so, um, also this sweater, not thrifted, it is from Shein. Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do and get the deals and I can't be blamed in, we're in late stage capitalism, so really can't blame me for any of my purchases. Anywho, thank you so, so much for watching and if you do check out my Depop, feel free to just message me. I am always down to do discounts. All right, have a good day. Bye.